very happy at the prospect of taking The Long Bond, my new book, to Poets Corner in October. And I thought I would read an October poem now. It's called Golden Delicious. Bagged from fluorescent stores, they're mealy, jello flavor. Greens and most waxed reds keep in a juicier crunch. But go out on a farm the tail end of October, pick some live, and then your taste loads color and a tone beyond the label. Though I can't say which feels better, savoring your choice among the yellow rose or the sheer seeing, after imaging small planets that droop such rich light from tips to bases of the laden trees. But best is when the child beside you reaches and tastes to be there with her at the core of autumn, while across time you recall holding the cool of the fine sallowed skin, pale, freckled, evenly covered in the palm with tiny scars that turns golden again, a branch length off or higher when the sun steps through cold cloud onto her ladder and touches the boughs around her arm. Golden-haired girl, there where the steady fruits bloom and have bloomed, weighted light above the pungent crush and bruise toward cider, where earthly coronas unwrap in the eyes that now reopen childhood deep and tongue becomes less cloudy. So then the crisp tart nectar fountains in the mouth, unsealing vaults of health that stay a while before the lapses, mostly blind in wax and brazen hunger toward shop-worn fool's gold.